welcome back to another video if it's your first time here my name is Beck. thank you so much for joining me so today's weigh-in video is obviously a weigh-in update and they're still outside my door i think they might have gone <sighs> So today's weigh-in video is obviously going to be my weigh-in update, but I also wanted to talk to you and just give a mention that a lot of people that I've seen are finding things a bit of a struggle at the moment. And I think it's perfectly normal, especially when you're going through something like this with not just the time of year that it is going from the summer to the winter, but all the things that are going on around us at the moment is obviously going to have a massive effect. So... I wanted to sit down because obviously it affects all of us. So I just wanted to speak to my consultant yesterday. I was on my Zoom meeting. I probably mentioned it yesterday in my video that there was only me. And I get that other people are busy and they can't always make it. But for me, committing to group is part of Slimmer World. And for the money that you pay in, it's just a little bonus. So when you're in lockdown and you can't go anywhere, there's lots of different reasons for people not being able to make it. But for me, I needed to just remind myself of everything about Slimming World. And even though when you're doing it, obviously you're learning as you're going along. So there's things that you pick up and you just know the sins of things and what's free and what's not. But things change a lot. So having that little meeting with my consultant she just lets us know any news any changes and for me that was good she also let us know about um i don't know whether anybody managed to watch any of them during the last lockdown and it was um sal's cooking videos so she made lots of videos from the store cupboard staples that we already had in the house which were fantastic and she's starting those up again i think tomorrow on Monday so I'll have a little look at those as well because they were really handy and they were really tasty and it just I think sometimes when you remind yourself of things and I was sat there yesterday morning I'd had my breakfast I'd had my meeting and just putting the effort in to just refresh things it kind of it just motivates you more well it motivates me more everybody is different obviously Simul has been a journey for the last nine months for me now and I started it for health reasons because aches and pains and extra pressure on joints that kind of thing but also just because I wanted to be a healthier version of me not just for me for my family as well so that's the reason I started it back and that's the reason I'm continuing it and Without the support of everybody that makes the lovely comments, that watches these videos, I couldn't do it. But it also helps me and inspires me when I see that other people are doing well and losing weight. And I love it when I get the, the comments from people about their weight losses. So if anybody is struggling at the moment, I guess I'm trying to say that, if anybody is finding a struggle at the moment, then this community is fantastic. People that are making these videos are on the journey. They're obviously going through everything that you're going through or have been through it and or will go through it. They may not have got to that struggle place. Struggle place is another thing. Struggle place, place that they struggle at yet. But along this journey, you can't be a robot. You can't be 100% on plan all of the time. Or maybe you can, I don't know. But I can't. And knowing that there's a community here that is helpful, that is engaging, is fantastic. So if anybody wants to drop me a message, either here, privately, on Instagram, whatever, I'm always here to talk and to listen. And that's all I wanted to say there. So yeah, yesterday, I think I, I did, did I even go off on a tangent then? I probably did. But that's kind of what I wanted to say in a nutshell anyway, and why I sat down. So... Uh, that's all I did. I sat down, I looked through this pack and I filled in the um, the Be Delighted book because I've had this for coming up to a year and probably have looked at it when I've been on calls with my consultant in the first lockdown, but I hadn't filled any of the pages in and there are a lot of pages to fill in inside the book. I don't know why I'm using one hand and that's going to end in disaster. So there's lots of things that you can... Ooh, 
there's lots of things there's questions there's books i don't know whether you're the sort of person that likes to fill in things that likes to see things written down i love writing things down i just never seem to have the time so yesterday morning i thought right i'm gonna sit there i'm gonna make the time because otherwise what would i be doing obviously the football is on and they've just scored or nearly scored because they weren't cheering um i made it in my mission yesterday morning to do that to go through that and and today because of it i do feel a lot more motivated so i'm not going to keep you any longer i'm going to go straight to my way in because that is what you're here for i'm actually really excited because i didn't all the writing in my books i did yesterday i didn't have this book <clears throat> which is my, obviously the one with my shinies on, the one that I write, write my weights in, but I didn't write my weight in. So when I've just come to recording this now and gone to check, I had to double check it because I'd sent off to my consultant what I was, but in my head, I thought I'd only lost one and a half pound, but it's actually two pound. So that was my weight this week. which means that I've been saying for the last two days, I lost a pound and a half. I've lost two pound and I've only got a pound to my three and a half stone. So I'm really excited about that because on yesterday's Zoom meeting, and probably lots of you have done it with your consultants as well, whether you're in groups or whether you're in your Zoom meetings as well, we were talking about Christmas and what we can achieve by then. So I said that I wanted to get my fourth stone. And she said to me, Oop. and she said to me, you could get your four and a half stone by Christmas. Now I don't want that much pressure on myself because that is a lot of pressure to think that I've got to lose a stone and a pound. If I could lose, because what is it to Christmas now? Is it eight weeks? Seven weeks? Yeah. So I don't want to put the pressure on, but I'm just going to carry on as I have been. So for the last couple of weeks, I've been having fairly what I would consider for myself big losses. And when I say big losses, anything over half a pound for me is a big loss because that is what I was losing for a long time half a pound half a pound half a pound but it was coming off and it was going the right way and I'm fine with that so like I always say I'm taking the scenic route and I'm fine with that because as everybody says it's not a sprint it's a marathon I'm in it for the long haul this is probably and this is no word of a lie people always refer to it as a lifestyle change it genuinely is because this is the way I, I hope to be eating for forever really. I'm going to wrap this up here because I am aware that it's going to end up being a really long video and I don't generally like to do long videos but I really wanted to say what I was feeling with regards to the struggle that it is and that it can be. Wherever you are I hope you're getting the losses that you're wanting and your week is going really well as well and if you do want to chat to me about anything drop me a comment down below you can inbox me directly at my instagram account and just know that there's always somebody there to listen as well it is a struggle we're all going through it together and i don't want anybody to think that they're on their own going through it either thank you so much for watching if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and i look forward to seeing you in the next one take care <laughs> Uh, welcome back guys. So today I'm talking about um, the magazine. Slimming World magazine with a person on the front who I have no idea who she is. If anybody else has children, they'll know exactly what that was all about then. Mum, look how much I've done. Woo! Oh, that's really good. Do you know how long it took me? How long? Oh, um, oh you started again? Like yep. six hours. Boring. That's really good. Maya's making a blanket. No. <sighs> Completely lost my trail of thought now. If you want to talk, drop me a comment. Oh, 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 oh. So I made made it made I made a mission.